Hello, you're watching weekly US stock market review on the InstaForex TV channel with me, Kate Nidatina. The US stock market showed mixed dynamic on Friday. The Nasdaq Composite posted all time high, encouraged by rosy Google report. The index added 0.9% to close at 5,210. 14, booking 4.25% over the week. Meanwhile, the Dow Jones index fell by 0.2% to 18,086.45 points. Nevertheless, the weekly increase of the blue chip index cloaked in at 1.8%. The S&P 500 rose 0.1% to 2,126.64 points. The weekly increase was 2.4%. 9 out of 10 index sectors closed in red. Investors priced in the quick news, hoping that the crisis is finally over. Apart from this, comments of Janet Yellen and her colleagues from other central banks widened on the trading sentiment. Speaking of economic data, inflation report uh, published in the USA on Friday showed an uptick. Building permits rose above the forecast and the previous reading, while Michigan Consumer Sentiment Index turned out to be below expectations. It dropped from 96.1 to 93.3 points. On Thursday, the U.S. Labor Department report on the number of unemployment claims showed reduction by 15,000. Now let's turn to the corporate news. Google shares jumped 16% on Friday amid an unexpectedly strong quarterly report to end the week on the record mark. Since the year started, the company's shares lifted more than 30%. In the second quarter, Google earned $3.9 billion, or $6.51 per share, going up from $3.4 billion, or $4.96 per share, a year earlier. The tech giant's income went up by 11% to $17.7 billion, as it was expected. Besides, Facebook Incorporated quotes uh, took an uptrend on Friday. The close level was $94.97 per share. The company's uh, shares notched a record intraday high, improving her third successive session. Currently, the popular social network experiments with a buy button, which allows companies to offer their products right on Facebook pages. It was weekly US stock market review. Have a nice trading with InstaForex. See you.